Well, this is James Mitchell. Today is the day. I am going to propose to my girlfriend. Uh, right now, I'm starting my day. It's Sunday, and I have church service. And so I've got to do two, uh, basically two sermons right now. Our usual Sunday school teacher is out today. So i got to do Sunday school. i got to do the regular service. And then I didn't get but about three hours of sleep last night in a combination of just being really nervous and uh, excited about today and also uh, uh, having been on the road and driving kind of late. But I'm excited. And so this next video, I'll give an explanation for anybody that may be watching this. Uh, I do a thing called geocaching. You can check out my other videos on my channel on YouTube. Uh, but I do the geocaching. And so I have placed it into Whitney's head throughout this week. And I've went and got a couple of geocaches. Well, I placed it in her head that there's a new one in the Lawrenceburg area on the square where there used to be an old one. Well, technically, the old one's still there, uh, and, and I'm telling a little bit of a fib. Sorry. Uh, but what I'm going to do is we're going to get there, and I'm going to set up on the square. And uh, at the square, there's a gazebo, and I'm going to set up right in front of the gazebo. We're going to be on the gazebo, and we're going to film towards it with my uh, new camera that I got here. And as we're filming, I'm, I'm going to set it all up, and as soon as I get ready to start filming, I'm going to send a text message to everybody. All right, and so here's you know my new camera. It does 4K video. I should be using that instead of my phone to record this, but it's easier to do my phone right now. Uh, but as soon as I send them that text, they will be behind a building a little ways away. This holder for my phone is not good. They'll be behind a video or a building for, for just across the street. And as they walk over, they're going to try to make it over quietly. And as they make it over quietly, you know, one of them, uh, one of my friends, probably Matthew or, or Hope, will text me and let me know that they're all lined up behind us and so as soon as I get that text and it vibrates as I'm talking I'm going to turn to my beautiful girlfriend Whitney and I'm going to propose and ask her to marry me and so I'm excited about it but hopefully this video turns out good and it's probably going to be a bit long but uh so forgive me for that but I'm excited and hopefully you uh can keep us in your prayers and your thoughts and uh hope for God to do a wonderful thing through our relationship as we progress further into uh, that area of our lives. Hey guys, it's a Tennessee Casher, and this is my lovely, beautiful girlfriend, Whitney. Uh, there actually has been a, a new first to find that popped up here, not too far away from here, in the next town over. And so before we go to church tonight, uh, so I'm in my full church get up, you know, I got a jacket too I'll put on here in a little bit. But before we go to church tonight, we're going to head over there, we're going to grab this and see if we can find this first to find. Uh, so stick with us in this video as we uh, try to find this geocache. So, this is Tennessee Casher, and of course, I told you earlier, uh, we we're coming to Lawrenceburg Square. We're going to get a new geocache. It's the first find. Nobody's found it yet. Um, it's been here for about a week. Uh, yeah, it was said it was placed on the second. And so, we've, we're here. We're going to look around. We know that it's somewhere around this gazebo behind us. And so, this is actually what's so significant about this is I've been geocaching since 2011. But, even though I've been geocaching since 2011, I haven't quite hit 100 finds. And so I'm going to hit 100 finds today with this first find. I thought that would be the uh, neatest way that I could uh, get my first find uh, count up, but also get my uh, 100 caches. And uh, I actually meant to bring, I have a 100 cache medal and everything, and that was going to be what I was going to show off and put in the cache. But this one's a micro cache, so I can't really do that. But that's good anyway. And so this is my lovely girlfriend, Whitney, by the way. And, uh, you know, you can remember her from one of our uh, Caves and Ammo Cans videos. So I'm glad that she has uh, chose to go with me today to do this, though. And so it's, it's kind of special to have her alongside as we geocache, something that I like. And, uh, it's kind of nerdy and everything else. But um, we're going to uh, find this, and I'm excited about it, and I think it's going to work out pretty well. And so, uh, but of course, like I said, I talk too much in all my videos, but that's quite all right. But anyway, thank you for uh, watching this, but hopefully we'll find this, and if we find it, it'll work out really good, and everything's going to go great. But anyway, the real purpose that we're here is not actually to geocache, because as you all see, there's people that have been gathering behind us right now, uh, behind the gazebo, and the real purpose of me being here and that I brought my girlfriend 
was that I'm going You're to propose so to my girlfriend. <laughs> and so, I don't know if the camera can pick this up now, but when what in the world? How? <laughs> <Ow! laughs> <laughs> Oh, you played me. <laughs> I believe the tape. Was it good? Yeah, it was awesome. Well, in the oh. book of First Corinthians, uh, chapter number 13, it says, Love is patient. Love is kind. It doesn't envy, it doesn't boast, it's not proud, it doesn't dishonor others, it's not self seeking It's not easily angered and it keeps no record of wrong. It doesn't rely on evil, but it rejoices. It always protects, it always trusts, it always hopes, it always persevere, and it never fails. And so Whitney, I know we maybe have a day to do this in the world, but one thing I do know is that we're God who has led us to do He's absolutely allowed me to fall in love. And in the love of my life, I was wondering, She said yes. I don't know if you could hear it, but she said yes.